Rob, if we just talk about London for a second, here's a team that was right at the top of the table, off to a great start, and then suddenly the last six, seven, eight weeks, it's all gone a little awry for them. Well, there's certainly plenty of time to go in the season, long way to go, but they've lost six out of eight in all competitions. And if we look at the other end of the floor, Coach Kapoulis and his team doing tremendously well. It's almost flipped the script from the last time we saw them. They just seem to be winning every week. But they've also done a good job of improving, and that's what you have to do in this league. You have to improve month by month. Bristol, definitely one of the teams that have done that so far. Coach Kapoor is talking about him before the games, talking about his intelligence on the basketball floor. Well, almost another turn of the London hat. Sands able to Pull it back in. Taylor's going to, well, he passes it off. Great pass, too. And Nick Tash throws it down and shakes oh. the basket. <laughs> Nick Tash hanging around on that rim. But Taylor doing a great job so far of finding his teammates for two. A wooming to Nick Tash. Taylor trying to lose his man, does lose his man, fires up for three and hits. Oh, -ho! hey, I can dish it, but don't forget, I can shoot it as well. Taylor with the long-range three. Ali throws it back over his head to Smith from deep, and he oh, strokes oh. Right back at you, Mr. Smith's edge. Nick Dash inside to Wells. Wells converts, and the buzzer sounds for the end of the opening quarter, and it's been pretty frenetic play here through the opening uh, 10 minutes, and it's the Lions who lead this one by five. Smith. Owen now, going inside to Smith. Smith zips it cross court to Boggs from 16 feet with the jumper. Here's Boggs, Boggs lets it fly, knocks down the three. Oh! No timeout called here as the Flyers open up a five-point lead. Nigel Lloyd calls for a break in play. Oh, stolen away. You won't catch Smith out in the break. Oh! He jams it down. And Boggs wasn't expecting him to go that way as well. Boggs driving in. Didn't quite have enough on that one. Oh, stolen away though. Here's Ali, fakes it, the pull-up, drives in, throws it oh, the oh. And Boggs is there, oh. throw it down. And we've seen Brandon Boggs. He's in there every week in the highlight reel. And this time, he took it high from Ali and threw it down with two hands. Good steal here from Street. And Ali, with a little shifty move, here you go, send it in. Here's Taylor. Taylor dumps it down, great pass, Zaya Taylor laid in by Hassan, and that'll do it for the first half, but way too, too long in coming those two points for the Lions. They got four fairly early on in the quarter, and then nothing since. Credit the Bristol defense, that's what's led them out to this 14-point. No question about it, six points uh, they hold the Lions to in that quarter. And some nice stuff on the other end. Bristol has to feel really good going into halftime. Jump shot doesn't go. It's all Bristol right now. Ali behind the back to Cosby. There's Ali now from behind the arc, and he hits a three. And the lead is out to 18. Ali pulls up again. Yes! Cut it out, Ali! No way. Ali again. Oh! oh! Man, he's on fire! Oh! No way. Here he is again. Oh! oh! My goodness! I think he got fouled on that one as well! And, wow. I, and Ali is walking around like a boxer out there. Looking at the crowd and the energy <laughs> that he has brought to this game. Wow. Taylor. Taylor driving in, throws it up, couldn't quite convert. Ah, it's in between two minds there, wanted to pass it last minute, took the shot. Cosby from behind the arc. That might go, it does go for three. And when it's going well, it's going well. It's weird, isn't it? It's, uh... Oh, another one. Oh! 13 of 21, the Bristol Flyers. Now they just can't seem to buy one. And as you say, last week they ran into the juggernaut that was Worcester here. And now 
they seem to have hit a wall against Bristol as well. We have to remember. Kobe! This is crazy now. Nice pass. Back door! Oh, yes, Street! With the spectacular Dipsy leg. do! He jumped on one side, put the spin on it, and finished on the other side. Nickel went. Hands stolen away, Boggs. It's clear for takeoff, hey! and he jams it down. Fly away, Boggs! Well, Bristol are flying away with this one. They have uh, 32 points in this period alone. The Lions have 41 in the game. Well, stop the fight. Somebody throw the towel in right now because they're just throwing haymakers and everything is landing, including that one. Wow. What can you say? Bigger at the elbow. Steps underneath. Oh. Kevin McHale, remember him? <laughs> I do. And I think one thing when you look at the league this year, you see a lot of these games coming down to the wire where you expect certain teams to win, but uh, you know, teams that are at the bottom of the table right now, uh, certainly competitive, no question about it. And in years past, maybe that wasn't the case. Well, what you've also seen is uh, Plymouth and Bristol really string the victories together, so I haven't been lower down the... Oh, my oh. goodness! The dose wow. comes up and throws it down! Let's take a look at this one again. Bring it back, big fella! He's going to just amble over the half, but what a second half. Well, I mean, even if you go back, what, three quarters again, they've really dominated this game. I had no doubt about it. First quarter, London in control, 25-20, but after that, all Bristol. Yeah, I mean, Ali got it started. That, I mean, that little spell where he just went bang, bang, bang. It didn't matter where he was, it was going up, and it was going in. Now, we've seen guys make threes, but the difficult threes that he was making, he got the bench going, and then Cosby, you know, picked up where he left off. And Bristol have to feel really good going into Sunday with this type of performance on the road.